Breaking news, Dwight Howard's going to get one with the Lakers. Woj reporting that a buyout with Memphis has been completed. It's going to be back in purple and gold once again. He did spend one year with the Lakers back in 2012-2013. More on that in a second. The DeMarcus Cousins ACL injury, as you know, has created a void. And apparently Rob Palenka and company have filled it for the moment. Woj joins us tonight here on SportsCenter. They worked out Howard, Joakim Noah, Maurice Spates. Why did they choose Superman? Well, Dwight Howard is the player that they see that can fill their needs to rebound, protect the rim. They saw a healthy back. They saw a player who had dropped 25 pounds. It has not been the talent with Dwight Howard that has made teams so skeptical about bringing him in. It is what he does in locker rooms with coaching staffs, with teammates. That is why I'm told he has a non-guaranteed deal. The Lakers can cut him any time before January 7th and not owe him any money for the rest of this season. Interesting. Sometimes your reputation precedes you. Before I let you go, you reported today that the Lakers players were involved in this process. Take me inside here. Well, Anthony Davis was one of those players, I'm told, who was at the facility, talked with Dwight Howard. They had everybody with him, management, coaching staff. Remember, Frank, Frank Vogel, Jason Kidd, uh, um, you know, they've got a lot of people invested in keeping him in line, and they sent a very clear message to Dwight Howard over the last couple of days. If you step out of line, if you become a disruption in any way around this team, you are out of here. Uh, he is very much on notice walking in with the Lakers, but they saw a humbled player. They saw a player who said all the right things, but Dwight has done that uh, for years, saying, I'm going to change. They're going to judge him on action over words right now. We'll see what develops. He may not be the same type of talent. Bottom line, he's still a three-time defensive player of the year and an eight-time All-Star. They'd love a fraction of that this fall. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For highlights and analysis, check out the ESPN app. And for live streaming and premium content, check out ESPN+.